All right, so the holidays, definitely not the time to start your strictest diet or have the strictest food rules, right? But there are things that you can do to stay healthy while socializing and having fun. Registered dietitian and nutritionist Dawn Jackson Blattner is joining us now. All green and beautiful for Christmas. Know, She's going to so break it all down for us. Okay. Yes. So let's start with some of the basics. Um, you said we shouldn't start the strictest diet plan. Uh, I, when you said that, I was like, yes, yes, yes. This is the holidays. This is fun. Don't start some sort of strict diet where you can't eat your favorite foods. You know, but sure, should I say as a dietitian, drink more water, eat more vegetables. Let me guess. Yes. Work out more? Yes, all of that. Right. Yes, yes, yes. But this year I said, you know, I really want to create an acronym that helps us more with the strategy of our mindset. Because you know what? Nutrition is so much more mindset than it anything. Right. And so I came up with an acronym called PARTY. Okay. Oh, I like PARTY. It. That's to, easy. Yes. to remember. Socialize and have fun with this PARTY acronym. Okay. You ready for it? Yes. So what does the P stand for? Okay, so P stands for my favorite. It's PLATE. Okay. So instead of standing over the appetizers, just like eating randomly, instead of like eating dessert over the sink, instead of just eating randomly, put everything that you want to eat on a plate. And science says, research says that you will actually eat less naturally hmm. and enjoy your food more just simply by putting it mindfully on a plate. That makes sense. It does that make makes sense. sense. Now, right. thoughts on the bigger plate versus the smaller plate. Because ah. I always do, I always pick the smaller thinking that, I mean, naturally right. there's more, less food on the plate, right? Yes, I mean, that actually does does work. Yeah, that actually so. does work. So I, I will say, if you have a choice of plates, yes, go with the smaller. A lot of times you can't even find a plate that everybody sort of assumes that you're just going to be grazing. So I say if you can just find any plate that's a first step, a smaller is even better. Okay. What, do, what are your thoughts about, I know we're going to go through the acronym too, but um, appetizers, maybe eat a few more appetizers because they're healthier, like veggie trays and whatnot, as opposed to the heavy desserts that come toward at the end of the buffet. Well, here that's a very interesting strategy. I like it. However, here's one of the things that we will be talking about is that if you have too many things, too many tastes of things, it stimulates your appetite and it's hard to get satisfied. Oh. So you're better off actually just picking favorite things and going in all in on that. Okay. I like that. Second like letter is A in party. Okay. A, this is activity. Okay. But, okay. But it is not to burn calories like everybody says. You want to be active during this time of year because sleep, right. stress, sure. energy, immunity, digestion, everything we need for like really having a joyful holiday season comes from being active yeah. to protect us on all those angles. So don't think about it as a calorie burn. Think about it in all those other positive ways. I like that. And the weather's been nice, so you can take a walk. Yes. You don't have to go for two miles, but yes. maybe around the block That's true. once or twice. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody loves a walk, right? Yeah. I mean, it, it is one of those things that I feel like people don't count it as exercise, but it is exercise. Sure. It's staying active, moving around. I love it. All right. Awesome. The R for party. Okay. So this is really where the mindset piece comes in. So this is reason for the season. Okay. So this is a reframe about, it's not all just about the food. Like, it's enjoy true. your food. That's Eat true. the food, enjoy the food. It's fun, seasonal food. But also really remember you're making memories and yeah. fun with your loved ones and your friends and your family. So really think about that as opposed to being obsessive about this food. I like that. And the tea. And yeah. the tea. For taste? Oh, tea is taste. Yes. <laughs> okay, so this is chew your food. People say this all the time, eat slower because you'll eat less. And when you're chewing, you actually will be less bloated That's and you'll true. have better digestion. So chew, taste your food, enjoy it, slow down. All right, yeah. the last one, the why for party? The why, this is your favorite. So here's what I say, don't eat what you like. Eat what you love. Prioritize oh. those things you absolutely love of the season. Because like we were talking about before, if you eat too many little things, it just stimulates your appetite. So really just prioritize your love affair with certain things and then really taste that, enjoy it, put it on a plate. So it's okay to go right for the sweets this time. Uh, if, you want, if you really like the sweets, maybe yep. go do that instead of all the appetizers and then the sweets. So your favorites would be what is your favorite one dessert. So instead of taking little bites of everything, really go and enjoy that. And I actually brought you a couple of like my little tricks. Uh, this digestive teas, these are Ooh, presents for you. This cool. is a little extra credit um, that when you're having that dessert peppermint. you were talking about, peppermint, awesome. ginger, and fennel teas are my triple threat of yeah. like, I just love drinking those with dessert. It helps your digestion and helps you slow down and really savor that dessert you're talking about. You are amazing. I get your newsletter every week. It's <laughs> remarkable. And you give great tips. You know, you say don't, don't, you know, starve yourself, but don't overindulge. So so well, you have great tips. Yeah, thank you for that. It's so key. At this time of year, enjoy your food. 
you know, enjoy your people yeah. and have fun. No one's starting yeah. a diet. Yeah, please. No one's no. starting. We're not, we're not, not doing not that. Next no. year. It's not coming that'll to this party. Be, be a resolution. Yeah, well, I'll be back in 2024. <laughs> we can talk about Dawn, that. Dawn, thank you so much for being with <laughs> thank us. Thank you. Happy and, holidays. Uh, that's her website right there at the bottom. You can get more information on Dawn.